Hey guys, it's Bradley for What's in the Box. So I don't know if you've been keeping track of, of me helping out at my local comic shop, but at the beginning of the year, I decided I was done in there. Um, owner's nice, but it's just too much negativity in there for me. So it was time for me to move on. So, But I still get books. I go in like once a month and pick up books. So here's the books I got for basically the first three weeks of January. Um... And then we had an ice snowstorm here in Oregon, caused some delays, caused some shipping issues, so I didn't get all the books for uh, January or end of December, beginning of January. So we're missing some books here. Uh, Star Wars High Republic, number four, Shadows of Starlight. We got The Amazing Spider-Man, number 41. The Mandalorian, number eight. Amazing Spider-Man, number 42. We got the Star Wars High Republic, number three. I don't like it there. Get too much glare. So we'll pull these guys down. Put this one up over here. Nope, uh, that's out of focus. There we go. We've got Alien at number three. They're rebooting that series again. You need to quit rebooting it. Cobra Commander, number one. We've got Venom, 29. Transformers, number four. Heard this is good. I haven't gotten into reading uh, this book yet. I'm way behind on reading. Uh, I heard the Cobra Commander and the Duke series is going to be a run of five issues. I'm not sure the Transformer run, how many issues that will be. Heard it's good, though. Uh, Blade, number seven. We get Invincible Iron Man, number 14. <coughs> Army of Darkness Forever, number four. I think there's two more left in that run. We got a Scorched, number 25. And another Scorched, 25 run. They usually always do two covers for Spawn books. Uh, here's a King Spawn, 29. Another King Spawn, 29 book. And Avengers, number one, this is the, actually, Spider-Man, number 41. This is the 100th anniversary of Disney cover that they've been doing. So they've been doing a lot of these uh, homage covers with Disney characters. So, so yeah, then we'll just go back through these. Just take a quick look as I pull them down. A little different uh, monitor setup. My main monitor died on me, so I'm having to use something a little different over here. So I'm not quite as big as picture as I'm used to. So let's run through these. Some good books in there. Should be some good read when I finally have a chance to actually blow some steam off and uh, read some books. What do you guys collect? Do you have a, a pull list at your local comic shop? Do you get a ton of books? Do you get one book a week? Let me know in the comments down below. Let me know if you're collecting any of these books that I picked up. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for tuning into this video. Thanks for tuning into my channel. I appreciate all my subscribers. Peace out, everyone. Till the next one.